The head of the International Energy Agency has called on the oil and gas industry to invest more in clean energy and abandon the belief that carbon capture technology is the solution to climate change. In a statement ahead of the United Nations Climate Change Conference, IEA Executive Director Fadi Birol emphasized the need for the industry to commit to helping the world meet its energy needs and climate goals. Birol stated that relying on implausibly large amounts of carbon capture is an illusion and that the industry must face the uncomfortable truth that scaling back oil and gas operations is necessary for a successful clean energy transition. According to Birol, just 1% of global investment in clean energy has come from oil and gas companies. He stressed that a significant increase in investment is required, with the industry needing to allocate 50% of its capital expenditures to clean energy projects by 2030 in order to limit climate change to 1.5 degrees Celsius. However, only 2.5% of the industry's capital spending went towards clean energy in 2022. The IEA report also highlighted the pitfalls of excessive reliance on carbon capture. While the technology is essential in certain sectors to achieve net zero emissions, it should not be used as a means to maintain the status quo. The report estimated that an inconceivable 32 billion tons of carbon would need to be captured for utilization or storage by 2050 to limit climate change to 1.5 degrees Celsius. This would require a staggering 26,000 terawatt-hours of electricity to operate, surpassing global demand in 2022. Additionally, the report stated that $3.5 trillion in annual investment would be needed from now until mid-century equivalent to the entire annual revenue of the oil and gas industry in recent years. While some oil majors, such as ExxonMobil and Chevron, are investing billions in carbon capture technology and hydrogen, others like Shell and BP have focused more on renewables like solar and wind. However, the IEA's message is clear. The industry as a whole must prioritize clean energy investment and reduce its reliance on carbon capture if it wants to play a significant role in the clean energy transition.